Hi guys, good morning and happy Sunday. Welcome back to my channel, Couponing with Kayla. So we are outside of the Walgreens this morning, about to head in here and check out some deals. I'm gonna walk you through the deals in the store, plus I'll have a printable list below the video. So you can print that out, take it to the store with you, and it's gonna help make your shopping trip super easy. Now, if you are completely new to my channel, welcome. Thank you so much for being here. And if you enjoy the video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up, as well as hit that red subscribe button below and the notification bell so you don't miss any new ones. Now we're gonna look at newbie friendly deals, spin booster deals, all of that. Plus we'll go over the receipt once I get done. Talk final cost, I'll let you know if there's anything to watch out for, all of that good stuff. So if you guys follow me over on Instagram, you may have seen me post the other day that I got a new car, which I'm super, super excited about. And if you've been following me for a while, you know that my car broke down right before Christmas and we got a new car for me, but it was kind of like a temporary solution. I've had some car trouble out of it a few times, but my husband and I, we've really been working towards getting me something that's more reliable and all of that. So I'm so excited. I got an SUV, which obviously I've never had before. And I did not realize you guys how updated cars are these days. Now it's a 2019, but to me, that's like new, new, you know, and also it has really low mileage. So anyways, I know that you're here for coupon deals, but I just wanted to share that with you guys. I love sharing, you know, what's going on in my life with you guys and good news or bad news, but hopefully good news. So we're going to go ahead and get in here and talk about the deals. Then I'll let you know if there's anything to watch out for all that good stuff, but just wanted to share that with you. Um, yeah, I'm super, super excited. And some of you guys gave me the tip that darker jeans can stain your seats. So I put a blanket under me because I do not want to stain the seats or mess anything up. So I'm trying to be super careful, but anyways, let's go ahead. Let's get into the store and check out these deals. All right, guys, so first up, we're doing some free oral care deals. We have this one right here buy two, get a $3 register reward on Colgate. We're going to grab two of these for $2.99 each, totals you $5.98. And we have a new three off two digital coupon that'll leave you to pay $2.98. You can pay with Walgreens Cash and you'll get a $3 register reward, making both of these completely free. So, an awesome, awesome deal. Now, another Colgate deal that we have right here is buy two, get $4 Walgreens Cash. So, this one we're going to grab two at $3.99 each. That brings our total to $7.98, and we're going to use a four off two digital coupon on this one. Pay $3.98, you can pay with Walgreens Cash, and you're going to earn $4 Walgreens Cash, making both of these completely free. So just really easy deals, and even if you have tons of toothpaste and you don't really need them, if you want to do these freebie deals, you could go ahead and donate them or whatever you prefer to do, but definitely a good deal to grab this week on the Colgate. Next, a really easy deal that you can do with no coupons at all is buy two of these Oral-B Floss for $2.79 each. That totals you $5.58, but you're going to earn a $5 register reward, making your final cost just $0.58 cents for both. So super easy deal. Next up, we have the Garnier Fruities, and this is another freebie this week. So it's buy two, get a $4 register reward. We're going to go ahead and we are going to grab two of these. So we are going to use a $3 digital coupon, gets us down to $4, earn a $4 register reward back, making our final cost on this one completely free. All right, guys, so if you have a spin booster, whether it's a paper or a digital, for spin 20, get five, you could pick up these items right here. Your total would be $20.96 before coupons. After your digital coupons, you're going to pay $10.96 out of pocket, but then you're going to get $5 Walgreens cash for the booster. You're going to earn a $3 register reward, a $4 register reward, and $4 Walgreens cash on the deals themselves, making your final cost completely free and a 504 moneymaker. So the Palm Olive this week is $2.49 and we have a $1 digital making it $1.49 for one. But check online because online they're showing two for $2.49. Use that dollar digital, it would make it $1.49 for two. But in store, they are ringing up $2.49 each. So just a heads up. So next, I'm going to pick up some bounty paper towels. These are $12.49 a pack. They're not on sale this week or anything, but I'm going to go ahead and pick these up because I have an 8 off 2 digital. 
Next, I'm going to grab some Charmin for $8.99. And I have a $1 digital for this Charmin. Now, I'm going to go ahead and put this with the bounty. And I'm going to hopefully do a deal for this. All right, guys, so I'm grabbing the Bounty and the Charmin together because it totals me around 33, I think it is 33.97. So I'm gonna use an $8 digital and a $1 digital on this. Now I'm gonna put it in a spin booster scenario to save even more because just alone it's not the cheapest, but on this, if we spend 30, we should get a $6 register reward. If that promotion is still going, the promotion I saw, I'll pop it up on the screen. It shows it through May 30th. So if that is the case, we should get a $6 register reward. So we'll see what happens after I check out, but I'm gonna go ahead and pick up these paper products. Next up, if you love Dove Body Wash or Dove Soap, they are buy to get a $4 register reward. Now keep in mind, this is the same deal as the Garnier. So if you want to do that deal of the week, make sure you do them in separate transactions so you get the register reward for each one. But your total would be $14 with two of these. Use a $2 digital, pay $12, you can pay with Walgreens cash, earn a $4 register reward, making the final cost two for $8 on these products if you want to pick them up. Next up, I was going to grab the soft soap deal, but I decided not to. But if you want to grab soft soap or Irish Spring, they're two for $10. Now we do have a $1 digital and you can print a 75 cent printable coupon off of their site. So that would get you down to $8.25. You'd earn a $5 register reward, making the final cost $3.25 for two. So definitely not a bad deal if this is your favorite body wash and you can pay with Walgreens cash on this deal. So next up, I'm going to pick up some Neosporin. It's $5.79, but we have a $1 digital. I'm grabbing this just because I need it. I got a cut on my toe that hurts. I need some Neosporin. And on top of that, you guys, I was cooking dinner last night and I accidentally got a burn on two of my fingers. So I'm just like, oh my gosh, I really need to get me some Neosporin. So I'm picking this up. All right, guys, so for my second deal that I'm gonna do today, I'm gonna be using two spin boosters. So I've got a spin 40, get nine paper booster. I'm also gonna stack this with a spin 65, get $15 Walgreens cash digital booster. So I'm at about $66 for the products that I'm gonna use for these boosters. So I'm meeting the highest amount so I can use both to earn extra Walgreens cash back. So I'm gonna go ahead and check out with my items and then we'll go over the receipts once we get back home and talk final cost of everything we're picking up. So guys, I forgot I had this little coupon. It's expiring today, $5 off skincare. So keep an eye out for something like this at your store on clearance for $5.29. It would make it just 29 cents. So we are back in the car from Walgreens. The transactions went pretty well. Only had two issues today and that was on my very first transaction. So when you're checking out, do you ever have it where it just it processes very slow, like it's going through and it's processing the digital coupons and then it takes forever for your total to pop up so you can pay and then it takes forever for your receipt to print. So that's what happened with this transaction. The cashier and I both were like, I don't know why it's doing this. I've had that happen before, so I kind of knew what to expect when it starts acting like that. Um, but it did miss one of my digital coupons, so I have to contact customer service for that. It was my $4 Colgate digital on that transaction, but my second transaction, it did come off, so not sure why. Um, then on the register reward deal, so basically for the bounty and the Charmin, I saw an advertisement just a little while back that showed it was good through May 30th. When you spend $30 on PNG products, you'll get a $6 register reward. Now, I have done that promotion a couple of times, not in my videos, but just testing different things out, what works. And when I got Charmin and bounty, it did work, but this time, it didn't print me anything. There's a new advertisement that starts today, and now it's not in the ad, but it is for the 22nd through a little while through June. So that one looks to be personal care products for PNG, where you spend 30, get a $6 register reward. I'm not sure because I didn't test it out today, but it for sure didn't print me anything for paper products. So um, missed out on that one. I will submit to Catalina just in case they will reimburse me for that. But if not, my total will be a little higher today but that's still not bad i think that it worked out really well because we had that really easy money maker transaction that covered some of our other purchase so let's go ahead let's head home go over the receipt and talk final cost of everything we picked up today 
Alright guys, so I am back home and this is my Walgreens haul for this week. We're going to go over the receipts, talk final cost of all of our items, and see how much all of this ended up costing us today. So the very first transaction that I did today, I did my large transaction with all of these items over here. But first, we're going to go over this transaction. Super easy. It's the one that I showed you guys in the store. Had no issues at all with this transaction, so that's a plus as well. So we picked up four boxes of Colgate and then two of the Garnier Fructis. You can see right here on my receipt, they all ring up correctly, no issue there. And then you can see down here, I had him scan my Spin 20, get five digital art paper booster. Um, I didn't have a digital booster on this one. Then you can see my digital coupons. I had $4 off Colgate, $3 off Colgate, and $3 off Garnier. That left me to pay a total of $10.96 out of pocket. And then on this visit, I earned $9.20 in Walgreens cash. Now you can tell this is a, an account that I do not use very often as I have $10 in Walgreens cash cash on that account but anyways so 1096 we got 920 back in Walgreens cash then you can see my two register rewards that I earned on this deal we have a three dollar manufacturer register reward and a four dollar store coupon register reward you can see right up at the top of each one so the three dollar one was for the Colgate that was 299 each the four dollar store register reward is for the Garnier Fructis and then on our Walgreens cash we got four dollars Walgreens cash for these two Colgate and five dollars Walgreens cash for our booster. So if we are adding all of that up, this transaction ended up being completely free and a five dollar and twenty four cent money maker. So that's an awesome deal to do even on its own this week. If you didn't want to do a lot of couponing, you wanted to get out there do a deal, that would be a super easy one to do. Now, if you don't have a booster, you would still come out completely free for these items right here. So either way, it's definitely a good deal. Now on my other transaction, now this one, it was not in the transaction. I did this by itself. Um, it was $5.29. I used a $5 store coupon. It was 29 cents. So I thought that was great savings on that. But again, it wasn't in my transactions for any of the other stuff. So I'm going to set it aside. Um, then we're going to look over this one. We got two of the big bounty so it says six super rolls equal 11 regular rolls so we got two packs of those we got the Charmin mega rolls the six equals 24 rolls um two colgate another two colgate i got my neosporin the garnier fruities and then we got the oral b super floss on this one so everything was around 66 dollars before any coupons or anything on this one you can see all of our items I believe everything rang up correctly as far as I could tell. Didn't have any issues there. Then right down here, you can see I had him scan my Spin 40, get nine paper booster. And I was also stacking that with a Spin 65, get 15 digital booster. Now I used all digital coupons on this. I had the $8 off of two, the Charmin or Bounty, and it depends on which kind you get. So make sure you're scanning in the store to see which ones qualify. Um, this one that was $12.49 a pack, it did qualify for that coupon. Then I used a $3 digital coupon for the Garnier, a $3 digital for the toothpaste. I had a $4 digital for toothpaste that didn't come off. And then I had a $1 digital for the Charmin. And I'm trying to think, what was my other? Oh yeah, my $1 digital for Neosporin. So my subtotal shows as $50.30 on this transaction. Now the transaction should have been $4 cheaper because that $4 digital didn't come off on my other Colgate. So once I contact customer service, I should get $4 Walgreens cash credit, but that should have made my total $46.30. Now on this transaction, you can see down here at the bottom of my receipt, I got back $28.66 in Walgreens cash on this deal. So on this one, I got back $15 for the digital booster, $9 for the paper booster, and then $4 in Walgreens cash for that Colgate deal right there. So $28.66, then in register rewards, these are the register rewards we got back on this one. $3 back for the Colgate one, a $4 store register reward for the Garnier, and then a $5 manufacturer register reward, and that one was for the Oral-B Super Floss. 
So, after all of that, it got us down to $5.64 for everything in that transaction. Now, keep in mind that I was thinking that, okay, by getting the Bounty and the Charmin, it would be over $30 worth and I would get a $6 register reward to spend on more PNG products. That promotion showed as going through the 30th, at least on the advertisement that I saw, but it did not print. So, like I told you guys, there's a new promotion starting. And if I have the paper, I'll show you. Oh, here it is. Okay, so this one, it may not include paper products. It may just be personal care products. But this one right here, it starts today, the 22nd, and goes all the way through June 30th. You get a $6 um, cash rewards with P&G when you spend $30 or more. And it shows the products and it has them listed there. Um, now that one, like I said, I don't know if paper products will work for it, so I wasn't expecting it from the new promotion, but was thinking it would come from the other one. It did not. So I'm going to submit to Catalina. They may or may not give me that $6. Maybe it was a misprint and then promotion's not still going. Not sure. Maybe I read it wrong, but if I were to get that $6 back, it would make the transaction free and a 56 cent moneymaker. Now, if I don't get that back, that's okay because, like I said, we paid $5.64 for this transaction. But over on our very first transaction, we had a $5.24 moneymaker. So if you subtract my $5.64 transaction from my moneymaker transaction of $5.24, that means that all of this today cost me $0.40, cents, which I think is a great deal. I'm super excited about it. No complaints here. So definitely let me know in the comments below if you're going to grab any of the same deals. I appreciate you guys so, so much for watching. And don't forget to grab that free printable list as well as all your money-saving apps like Ibotta, Fetch Rewards, and more in the description box below. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.